Uh, this is my uh, Schnitzel King truck. The food is uh, Eastern European. I'm Czech, and my girlfriend's Polish. And uh, Schnitzel was something my mom would grow up cooking for me. It's called Renski in Czech. I don't know what's called Polish, but everyone knows the name Schnitzel, so I just called it that. And I also do uh, kolachkis along with uh, some other like Eastern European desserts and a really good potato salad. started by uh, cooking in the South Park in a lot of the Chicago Bears games. And uh, Mario Toronto, who uh, sponsors us, he uh, told me one day I should start selling these sandwiches. And um, I lost my job. I took my remaining cash and started my truck. The uh, truck, I, I wanted to go something that was small so I could drive around easy. And uh, I think it was a real eye catcher too. You don't see too many of these anymore. It's an old right-handed uh, postal jeep. And uh, I think I get a lot of attention plus the crazy crown I built. It's a lot of fun. The best part is definitely uh, the cool trucks to meet like uh, Teddy over in Alameda and uh, meeting all the interesting people in the city. Definitely the uh, pork schnitzel, the Chicago schnitzel sandwich, I call it. I serve it on fresh Toronto bread with uh, sauteed pepper and onions. And I think it fits like the palace of the city well, the people of the city well. gets made at the uh, Berwyn VFW Hall, and so every time you buy something off the truck, part of the proceeds go right back into the veterans, and they can be sure to use the money now with um, a lot of veterans coming back from uh, Iraq and Afghanistan, right. so it's helping out, helping them out as well. Uh, I got a future plan for if we can cook off the vehicle for a really cool truck, but uh, I'm not going to say what it's going to be, but I think it's going to be really killer in the city, and it's going to definitely be... Uh, I kind of think unique like the Jeep that I built. I think it'll really catch people's eyes and uh, the sandwiches will be really good.